Hello everyone, I'm here to show you the IQ Wood Maze, the purple ball. It's four stars, it's not too difficult, even though it says four stars. But it takes a bit to get used to the holding of the, the ball and all the pieces. So here we go, let's, let's start. So, let me just set that up. Okay. Hopefully you can all see that. I don't have the proper setup here. But, okay. So we have our ball. Okay, there we go. That's better. Okay. So we have our ball like this. There's a, one piece in here that kind of moves. You just got to find it. There it is. That one. So once you get your, your ball, you'll notice that one slides up and down like this. This one rotates. All right, that's how you get your ball apart. You can identify the pieces as they come out, but really, you don't really need to. It's identifying the pieces afterwards. I'll show you. So we have two of these pieces. They look like this. Very simple. Find the other one. Those pieces will go on last. So put those to the side. And then every other piece is different. So your main piece, your starting piece, looks like an E. It's got those big grooves and looks kind of like this. And this is your other piece. It has no other grooves on the bottom, just a thin one at the top. And those are your first two starting pieces. So what you do is you slide it together like this, put it in like that and just kind of hold it like that next we're looking for this piece this piece is very straightforward and you rotate it like this and it slides down here and connects at the bottom like that very simple All right so now the tricky part is getting used to holding it the next piece is like this and that just plops over like that. Very straightforward. And the key is to balance it all so it doesn't fall apart. So once you get to that point, you rotate it with that flat surface on like this. So now you have your two finishing pieces that are the exact same. The key is to get space that out without it falling i don't know if you can see that i don't want to angle it too much but then you you slide this piece in i believe it's this way we might have to redo it yeah you want to face it up so i think this is correct and then you you rotate it that way so did you see that hopefully i don't wreck it that's the way you want it you slide it in this way very simple and then you rotate it like that right the next final piece is like this, and you plop that down like that, straight down. Oops, make sure that one's in there. And that should just plunk in like that, and your final piece is that one that rotates. Click in, done. You got yourself a ball, and it's very easy to use. So, thanks for watching. I'm. Puzzle Master Stace, and we'll uh, they're all rotated over. Um, we'll try again next time. Thanks a lot, everyone. I'll have some other puzzles to show you. I don't know if you can see that. That was the the wood maze purple ball. Anyways, have a good day.